So yes, we had uh, Superintendent Horton and his uh, cabinet that came through today to do a roundtable talk, um, to hear about our school, what's working, what's going on at the school, um, and also to hear our concerns and how the district can support us. So um, he was able to listen to all of our stakeholders and, um, and also uh, give us feedback as, as to how the district is going to support us. Well, Avondale is, a, I know people like to say uh, they're the diamond in the rough, but we are actually the diamond in the rough of DeKalb County. Uh, we're a great school, pre-K through five. We're an IB school and also a STEM certified school. Uh, we have a, a, a great parent involvement, um, a high teacher uh, retention rate at the school, and we're moving things this year. This year we were highlighted as a Title I reward school and also a literacy leader for our third graders on the Georgia Milestone. So Avondale Elementary is a great place to be. So this was a great opportunity to finally meet one-on-one -on -one with Dr. Horton and his team. I think it's very important for him to come to the schools. I like the hands-on approach. I think that have taken the time of his schedule really ask us what we need to get to know the schools better. I think that's a great opportunity for not only him as the superintendent, but a way to get out to the, the other schools, the great things that are happening throughout the district. So Robert Shaw currently serves about 312 students. What's unique about Robert Shaw is that we have um, at least four different languages represented, excluding English here. 95% um, of my parents speak English as a second language. Um, we are a national distinguished school through the ESEA, as well as a Title I distinguished school and a Title I reward school. What makes us so unique is that our students are, they come in, they stay from pre-K to fifth grade. We have a very diverse staff, as well as a very diverse student population. Um, I love working here. I've been here since 2009 in three different capacities, and I'm so proud to serve as the principal here at Robert Shaw. At the round table, we were honored by Dr. Horton and Champion Dillard and their team. Um, it was a great interview session. Um, we were able to really uh, speak what is going very well here at DESA. And we also were able to speak very candidly on some things that we'd like to see in place. I feel as the principal that our voices were heard. Um, we are very proud of the work that's taking place here in DESA, and we are just grateful that support and help is on the way from our superintendent and his team. Some highlights of DESA is that our students are able to go and tour at other schools so that their peers can see the talents and their gifts and what they are learning here every day at DESA. Some great highlights, our PA teachers are some of the best in the state of Georgia. Some of our instructional staff, they are the best in the state of Georgia. One person that really stands out to me that has been promoted from our staff is our mental health coordinator. Always willing and able to help us out in every area. And I accredit that to Dr. Horton uh, putting mental health coordinators, um, ELA coordinators, math coordinators, special education coordinators in place. And the work is really showing here at DESA.